It's Gamer on Grand Street. Ooh. Yo, guys, what's going on? Gamer on Grand Street. Bringing you guys another Call of Duty commentary. I don't necessarily know what the gameplay in the background is going to be. I'm sure it won't be horrendous. I'm not even sure what Call of Duty it's going to be. So I do apologize for that. It pretty much be whatever one fits. Um, so, I want to start with this commentary. I want to talk about a subject that's kind of going around, I guess. I want to talk about YouTube and how it is broken and how YouTube has admit admitted it is broken and I have a point of example here let me pull up my Google Chrome um, so if you go to my channel uh, if you guys even see this video and for me I go to my creator studio go to my video manager I have a Black Ops 1 Livecom uh, with the stoner LMG and it was published May 18th at 5 30 at night and it has been published and public and everything everything's ready it's ready to go and everything and so it has no likes views or comments and I know that oh I'm complaining about likes and views wrong um I have two people that watch my videos semi religiously and you guys will find them in the comment section Luke most of the time and Mike sometimes you'll see uh, you'll see like Luke pretty much every time actually and he likes my videos comments on the videos and watches them so there should be at least one view a like and comment Mike will randomly like the videos, doesn't comment all too often anymore, but he watches them. And I, I discussed with both of them, you know, you know, I put out this video once during a live time. And the thing was, Luke actually wanted the video. He wanted a uh, an LMG gameplay from Black Ops 1. He wanted the stoner, which was my gun of choice, and then he wants me to do one with the RPK, which will be coming shortly. I just have a lot of other videos I have, I have to go up. I have six videos on my desktop at this current second. So they both said they didn't see it in their sub box and both of them checked YouTube semi religiously. Luke's on it. Luke gets home. His parents don't really let him go anywhere. He lives in a, he was like two towns over. But he goes to my school. And so he didn't see it in his sub box and he chills on uh, YouTube and Facebook pretty much the majority of the day and plays video games, which I'm not knocking on him. Good for him. Um, but they, he didn't see it in his sub box. And neither did my buddy Mike. So there's obviously a serious problem here. And I'm going to link the video down. It's going to be the top link in the description. Um, go check it out if you guys want to. But YouTube, it's broken. And uh, it sucks to say that because it. when I started YouTube, I did a, I had a channel back in 07 and 08. I didn't really post a lot of videos, but it was kind of like a personal channel. I subscribed to people, watched people, and did all this other stuff. And I uploaded like five videos in total. YouTube was so much simpler of a system. When I when someone posted a video, I saw it. There's times where I don't see T Martin videos, which really sucks because he's one of my favorite YouTubers. But there's just times I won't see it or whatever happens to it, it just goes away. So I just wanted to, you know, talk about this real quick. I wanted to give you guys my opinion. I honestly think it sucks. It's uh, it's sad how the how YouTube's gone downhill these last couple years because I haven't a viewer uh, for for quite a long time, but. As a content creator, I know it must. It sucks for me when people don't see my videos, especially like that live com took me like six or seven games to get, and I worked hard on it and tried to get everything together. I tried out a bunch of different attachment setups and everything, and like it, it, you don't you don't realize a lot of work actually goes into this. Live coms are kind of like they're not, they're not as hard to edit or make as this will this will be, but it'll be well worth it. But like. I spend six or seven games getting the live cam, and then I have to edit it and render it. The rendering could take like ten minutes because my computer actually I got an upgraded computer, but like the editing could take ten minutes because it is live cam, and then getting the gameplay could take an hour. So I'm already into it for an hour and a half, and then uploading the thumbnail takes another five minutes to make. Uploading could take however long depending on how my internet wants to act that day. So like, it, it, YouTube videos could take a lot of effort and a lot of time out of your day. And it sucks that you you don't get to see the the outcome of that. It really it, it sucks. Uh, you don't get to see anyone watching or viewing your videos, and it it can get annoying. I can understand that, but I just felt like giving you guys my opinion on this. Um, seeing as how I know it's a commonplace topic nowadays, and kind of just give you guys my opinion. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Leave a rating, uh, depending on how you felt about the video. Comment. Give me some constructive criticism. Go check out the video. Top link in the description will be the BO1 Livecom. And subscribe if you guys are new. Peace, peace.